Steve Jensen from Superior Search Consultants and I have a tip for those that are looking for job opportunities and have come to the point where a company wants to make an offer. And I've seen a lot of people, it's unfortunate, really burn bridges and it ends up costing them later down the road. And one example that I want to give you is when it comes to an offer, if a company makes a, an offer and that candidate wants to counter offer, the best way you need to do this is you need to come up with a number that you'll accept. And when you present that back to the company, you need to let them know, here's the numbers, this is what I accept, you know, do the best that you can. And you never want to get set in a situation where the company comes back and then presents the offer to you and then you tell them, well, I want to still think about it. That'll immediately burn the bridge in most situations. Another thing that I wanted to point out is that when you get an offer, you want to be sure that you understand that if you turn that offer down in most circumstances, that company is going to hold it against you later down the road and not consider you. It, there are certain situations where that's an exception, but most of the time, if you turn a company down, they're never going to uh, want you to come back. And that's just, it's unfortunate, but that's the way things are. So just be sure that you're aware of that. Uh, getting five different offers is not always the best situation to be in. It is nice to have different choices, but just remember to keep that in mind. Be courteous to the company. Make sure that you appreciate their interest. And be sure if you're counter-offering, be sure you come back with something specific that you'd accept. So there's no going back and forth and you don't burn the bridge. I hope that helps. Look forward to hearing from you. If you're looking for opportunities, please visit our website. Now, there's thousands of jobs out there for professionals. Look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.